internet it's me Holly and Ipsy it came a little early you guys like I didn't expect it to be here it came Saturday and uh, today is Monday so I was gonna open it over the weekend but I had a pontoon trip yesterday with my family and things got crazy so then I was like I'm gonna film it when I get home but then my makeup was all weird and I fell asleep on it so it was nice because you know with the job that I do I work most weekends so to like have a fun filled weekend was pretty cool but I want to note before I open this it's like really heavy like I noticed as soon as I pulled this out of the mailbox this is way heavier than the normal weight of my ipsy bags you know what I mean? So like I picked it up and was like, whoa. So I'm kind of excited to see what's in here because this is way more heavy in weight than normal, like I said. So let's just get into it. So here is my Ipsy unbagging for August. Yes, this is August. Also, you'll note I'm in here. Normally I do my unbaggings in the dining room, but to be honest, I really didn't feel like sitting down there. So, I like my room. So, if you're wondering why I'm in here and not in my dining room, that's why. Also, I got a new furniture piece. It's really big and it sits behind where I normally sit. So I'm not sure, like I have to figure out camera angles and stuff, so, but that's like totally off subject, but you know I do a lot of rambling, so let's open this bag. Ooh, huh. All right, there's stuff outside of the bag. Wait, okay, let me get the card first. So, Sugar Highness, here is the card. Live that fantasy. Pop the champagne cans, deck yourself in ring pops, Get gorgeously glammed up and dip into everyday decadence gone wildly galore. So, yep. Ooh, okay, so I got stuff outside of the bag. Is that it? Okay. Oh, you guys. So, okay, I got, ooh. Okay, so I think I got, yeah, I got some masks, which I love getting face masks. These are by the company Secret Garden. They sent me two. Uh, the first one here is Secret Garden Chamomile Oil. They say wedding invitation on them, but I'm a little confused as to what weddings have to do with these face masks. You know what I mean? And the second one also says wedding invitation. It's also, they have a different language on here too, so maybe it explains better, I don't know. But this is also Secret Garden, and this one is Olive Oil. Okay. So let's open, let's see what's in this box. Oh my god, you guys. Ha! Ah, this is so cute, look! Do you guys see that? Like seriously, that is adorable. And the material is like, some of the bags are really, okay so the back is just white and then it's got like a pale pink zipper. Some of the materials are really cheap they feel kind of cheapy but this feels like really expensive like the feel of it and the picture is so cute she's got like a little crown of like makeup <laughs> this is definitely one of my favorite bags i really really love this one it is super adorable okay so the first thing i am pulling out of this bag is okay it's called winky lux Here's the packaging. Let me see. Diamond powders are girl's best friend. This foundation powder contains genuine crushed diamonds for the ultimate coverage and glow. Like real diamonds? Could you imagine how expensive that would be? I mean, there's no way it's real diamonds and costs cheap. You know what I mean? Oh, okay. So we got a little bit of a pressed powder. I love trying powders but I kind of get disappointed when I get them in my ipsy bag because the powder samples are always really small so I mean I don't feel like I can do much with this and I'm oily so I wear a lot of powder uh, so I it's just it's always hard to tell with this but the packaging is super cute check it with the little diamond can you see that 
yeah, I'm kind of on the fence because I love these kind of products, but they never give me quite enough for me to feel satisfied with it. Next thing in the bag is uh, Ciedi, Sieta, Sieta London. I know I'm not saying this right. Uh, we have, it's called Spinning Teacup. It is a nail polish. I, uh, I'm not too thrilled about getting nail polish because... Well, I mean, today I actually do have my nails painted, so that's kind of a bad example, but I normally don't. Yeah. Uh, you know? Uh, it is a really pretty color, though. I will give it that. It's a cute, like, light purple color. So I'm thinking that that'll be pretty nice. I've never heard of this brand before. It's... Yeah. I mean, yeah. So we have nail polish. Next in the bag... Ooh, okay. It Cosmetics, and the few It Cosmetics items they've sent me so far have been amazing, so I'm not going to complain. Um, some of these packages are like kind of bent and open already. Clinically proven, waterproof all day. No tug waterproof gel eyeliner. Okay, side note, I loves me some gel pencil eyeliner. Like, I don't even like to use regular eyeliner pencils anymore. Like, I like the gel pencils. You know what I mean? Like, they're like a hybrid of, like, a regular pencil. They seem to be more, like, pigmented, and they seem to smudge a lot less. So, before I... Here is the packaging before I take this out, but it's already falling out because the package is kind of crushed a little. So, I mean, it's a sample size, so it's not like a full size, but still, like, It Cosmetics is kind of pricey, in my opinion. It's one of those Lux brands, so I'm pretty happy with this, and this will probably be my favorite thing in the bag. I don't know. Let's keep looking. And the very last thing in the bag... Ooh, this is why it was so heavy. <laughs> I think this has, like, become kind of a joke on my channel at this point. What do you guys think I just got? I'll give you a hint. It's the thing I complain about every single month. Every single month, okay, if you're new to my channel or, you know, you don't know me or haven't watched my channel or whatever, every month I swear it never fails. I get either a leave-in treatment or a serum. I've got thin, oily hair, so most of those are no-go for me. So, of course, the biggest, most expensive thing probably in the, in the whole thing that was why the package was so heavy is it's called It Hair Care 12-in-1 Amazing Leave-In Treatment. Now, like, I even like, like, deep conditioning treatments. If I use a little bit and don't, like, go into my scalp, it, it's amazing. But I just, these leave-ins never work for me, and they always make me feel, my hair feel really oily and gross. I'll try it. I've heard of this brand. I know that everybody who's tried this has really liked it, like, among my friends and, like, people that I know and watch or whatever. So I'll give it a whirl, but I'm not, I don't have any hopes for it at all. Like, I just assume it's going to be a big fail. Overall, I gotta say, probably the face masks and the eyeliner were my favorites. I'm very much looking forward to those. I love the powder and I'm really excited to try it, but like I said, it's not really like the best size. And the nail polish is kind of meh. I'll take nail polish, but I'd rather take like a like a face makeup product instead. You feel me? Uh, but overall, too, like, I mean, this bag is actually pretty good. I actually really like this bag a lot. And as far as the actual physical bag goes, this is one of my absolute all-time favorite bags. The bag itself is freaking cute. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm gonna go tonight as soon as this is done and put this into my purse, like, right now. Like, today. So, that concludes my Ipsy bag of August 2016. What did you guys get in your bag this month? What did you get that was different than me? What did you get that was the same as me? Let me know in the comments. And yeah, you guys know the drill. Like, subscribe, share, invite your friends. Follow me over on Instagram and I'll see you in my next video. Have a good day, guys. Bye. You guys, this bag is so freaking cute. Cute.